roaring game today. It was uh, settled by uh, a cruelly deflected goal. Yes, it was. Um, we're disappointed to have lost the game. I thought we we uh, put a lot of effort in today and really sort of tough team performance. But you know, on, on the on the balance of play, they deserve to win it. But that aside, I'm really pleased with my team and the way they put themselves about. Yeah, clear cut chances were were few and far between. But in terms of effort, commitment, and determination from, from your side, you really got that today. It was a big challenge for us. You know, I, it's. Recovery from the Wednesday night game was, was was difficult, and we had you know real issues in our back four, as you probably could see from from selection. You know, six six members of our of our sort of back four, of our squad were all missing today, which gave us. And I think to 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 have defended as well as we did, we finished that game with three at the back there with um, Kane Wilson, Jordan Story, and Dean Moxie. I think it shows a lot of a lot about the way that the squad pulled together and, and tried really hard today. Um, you know, we, we, we thought 1-0, no, we had a chance. We had a chance of nicking one at the end. That's what it was going to be. It was going to be a case of nicking one and we couldn't quite do it, you know. So they were a good team and on the flow of play, they had plenty of tacks on our goal. But, um, you know, I think we, uh, we, we, we're we proud of the way we played today. Yeah, looking at the positive story in, in particular, first league start for him, he was he was rock solid. Yeah, good, great experience for him. Um, you know, he's, it's, it's the, that's the benefit of having a, a squad and a, a, a Sort of development in your young players and a proper reserve team you know probably um, a couple of months ago to see himself as seventh choice centre back and you know a couple of months later he's, he's starting again and that just shows you the way that where we work you know it's okay he probably was seventh choice seventh choice a few months ago but you still have to develop those players as if they're next in line and, and Matt Taylor's done a brilliant job with him and Andy Tilson um, especially and the, the, you know the way the reserves function really really um, correctly means that players like Jordan Story can step up and play and well done him today. Yeah, that's possibly one of the, the toughest debuts he could get at, at the, the League Two leaders. So what will that do for his confidence personally? Well, it would boost it, of course. It's a great experience for him and I'm, I'm sure he'll be disappointed if we've lost because he's part of this team. But, you know, he'll, he'll go home today and I'm sure he'll be, he'll be really pleased he's had his chance and done so well. Yeah, didn't get the result today, but the form generally prior to this was, was, has been really, really good. Next up, Wickham. Yeah, you know, form. Yeah, I mean, if, if, if you're talking about form as results, yes. Form in terms of where we performed, yes, again today. So I, I see no drop off in the form today. If you're talking about results, of course, yes, we have lost it. But um, we've got a lot of games to go. We wanted to get something from it today. We almost did. Um, well, we were jumping up and down over there when we thought we'd scored. But you know, sadly, it wasn't to be. Yeah. What's the, the latest on the injuries at the moment? Lots of changes, in, some of them in force today. What, what's the latest? Well, you know, t today, more Taylor, Troy Brown, Luke Kroll, Troy Archibald, Craig Woodman, Pierre Sweeney were all injured today. So that's, that's six out there. And Harley, as you know, was, was missing as well. So that was a, that was a fair, fair lump of, uh, of the squad missing. So the, 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 the hope would be we'd be get, getting some of them back um, for next week's game against Wickham, which will be a crucial game. Yeah, thanks for your time.